How's it going guys, Jace here back with another standard deck tech. Today we have a kind of a mono white life gain deck. In best of one, there is just so much aggro. Since the ban ends, we, I think we've been seeing way more aggro than there ever was. More mono red, more soldiers, more mono white. Just these really fast, out the gate aggressive decks. Now those decks were still pretty strong anyway, but I do feel like with the Fable decks, they were just able to have so much removal in those decks and get some such good color advantage that they were able to just hold all of these very fast aggressive decks now we don't really have that it's a bit tricky it's kind of like the what i'll say wild west it's basically aggro or ramp and that's pretty much it so let's take a look at what we got today so basically it's mono white life gain deck and we'll just see how this goes praise on aggro so we've got four copies of lay down arms great cheat removal spell especially a mono white you don't really care about the life gain that much you just want to get rid of a creature then we've got two copies of the farm hand this is great to help hit our land drops and to get the planes for the lay down arms then we've got four copies of vasification great removal spell deals with planeswalkers deals with any creatures get the attractors out of the way overall pretty good three copies of the doggo the spirited companion really good two drop lets you draw a card smooth out your draws quite nice then we've got four copies of wedding announcement which is just a really powerful enchantment. It's another card which I was thinking it could have been banned, but it's not, so it, we're playing in this deck. We've got three copies of Archangel Elspeth. Hey, look, it makes life gain creatures. That's <laughs> the main important thing, indeed. And it's a good Planeswalker. It's good against, like, control decks. It makes a bunch of threats. Kind of plays in a similar role to the Wandering Emperor. That's why we're playing in this deck. And we've got three copies of Archangel of Wrath. It has lifelink in it, but that's why we're splashing in black and red. Just so we can kick this card because it is very good against like mid rangey you know aggro matchups we've got three copies of sarah paragon great in the grindy matchups overall a pretty good fire you know three four allows us to bring back any potential destroyed wedding announcements or the little guys to get some card advantage then three copies of wandering emperor probably the best one of the best planeswalkers especially in this deck anyway or this style of deck you know can make threats in life exile creatures very very cool We've got four copies of the Boom Bring of Valkyrie. Basically Baneslayer Angel, right? Five mana, four, four, flying. Fresh Light Lifelink. Most of the time it's just a five, five. Huge. You know, most aggro decks you play this and they're just like, yep, I'll concede. So that's why we're running that. And then we've got three copies of Steel Seraph. It gains more life. It's a bit of a pain for people to deal with if they only have Go for the Throat. That's why we're playing that. And then we've got a bunch of planes. Then we've got some red, black, jewel lands and white, black, jewel lands just so we can kick the Archangel. And then we've got a few... Try lands to trigger the planes for the laydown arms. If you want to give this deck a try, guys, deck list, of course, is in the description below. We'll be playing some best of one standard games. Let's see if we can crush some aggro. On the play, yeah, I like this. Good hand. Good hand indeed. Oh, nice. Two drop. Two drop, four drop removal. Gets mono red. Okay, I think this hand could be okay against mono red. Uh, I think we'll just play the dog, I think. Fairy land. Yep. Go spit. Sure. Definitely blocking that. 100%. Okay, so I think we go land, farm hand, grab a planes. Yep. Lay down arms this and pass. Not actually looking good for me here. No, nah, not really. That would have been better to lay down arms, but okay. Take the damage. Ooh. That was a good one. Get rid of that and pass. So I think next time we play Elspeth, we get one one block of life link, which is quite nice. Yep. Yep. Take four. Land, play Elspeth. Make a 1-1. One, one. Sure. 
around a chicken. Well, they can do with Elspeth. They sent everything Elspeth. If they do, I won't block. Yep. It's absolutely fine. Okay, could do a board sweeper, but I don't have him in this deck. Laid on arms, good draw. Um, yep. Do the same again. Laid on arms that. And pass. Now, at the moment, they can't kill Elspeth. Double block one of these. Nice. They land. Like this. Makes no real difference. And pass. Got a 5 4 flyer, which is quite tricky for them to deal with. Elspeth's putting in work. Take the flames. Okay, the invasion. Yep. Well, well Elspeth is dead. No play with fire, surely. Very good. And oh boy. Well, that's game. Vigilance. Bang. Four four first strike. Life linker. Find life linker. This is why I built this deck. Of soldiers and mono red. There we go. Okay, right, Pun's going first. I'll keep. Keep that indeed. Aggro. Nice common trend. Impest of one. Yep. Yep. That's getting exiled as well. Get out of here. Yep. No land, we'll play wedding announcement. Through a third lay down arms, that's good against all these these aggro decks. Yep. That one's getting exiled as well. Oh. Ooh, that's good. That's a good draw. And just pass. Next turn we'll play the Archangel. Uh, maybe. I'll just play the Boom Bringer Valkyrie. To be honest, this is how you beat <laughs> an aggro deck. You just have all the removal and two big. Big flying frets. Yep. Um, I will attack. No, I won't. Nope. Rukathar. Go. Get some Archangel action going. My opponent's feeling pretty good about that, and I'm like, not today. Okay, that's absolutely fine. Block and block. Take two. Fair land. Um, like this. And kill the Brutal Cathar. 
<laughs> there we go. Hey, look, just have removal of big flying life linkers. Uh, well, that's definitely a mulligan. That's a, mm, it's a bit better. Get rid of the Wandering Emperor. Over to you, man, go. Okay, definitely need to hit land. It's mono black. Okay. Okay, did hit land, lovely. That wedding announcement down. And then see what we got. Yep. So, next turn, I hope to draw a land. That'd be pretty sweet. Okay. A fight? And you think oh, you're going to tick up? Win. That's what I would do. I'll probably tick up. No, all right. Oh, I've always hated clowns. Elspeth. Hmm. Get this down now. And makes no real difference. They probably, well, they might not be playing anything to re that can remove the Steel Seraph, so we'll have to wait and see. They rely on go for the throat. They can't. I'll discard lay down arms. Yep. Hmm. Yeah, that's gonna be difficult to deal with. Need to land there. Big time. Alright, let's just pass. Definitely needed to land that. Yep, I'll get rid of a token. One of your friends has to leave. Yeah, definitely need a hit. Ideally, a, a like a, an untapped land. Uh, it doesn't have to be untapped, but just a just land. Remove this, otherwise, or an ossification. Another lily. Okay. Nobody knows Dominaria's shadows like me. Yep. <laughs> Haven't you ever heard of personal space? Okay. That's a lot of damage. I want three. Ah, uh, hopefully here land. Oh dear. Well, get rid of one of these. Um, give it vigilance. Kill the lily at least. Yeah. Oh dear. Well, I'm dead. That was tough. That was tough. I needed. I need a land. Didn't get it. Okay, opponent's going first. Uh, yeah, it seems fine. Seems like an okay hand. Who we're playing against? Okay. Well, let's get exiled. Right away. No way am I letting that stay around. No way. Oh, that was a good draw. No way, indeed. Grab another planes. Okay. Gonna hold up Tyvar's stand. Um, I tap land. A spirited companion. Get that card draw going and then pass. Ooh, that's a good draw. That's a good draw. Location. Probably just gonna get prevented anyway. Yep. Jump. Yep. 
Or that got under the bus. Okay, scrolls hive. Lay down arms. Uh, I think here yeah, we're gonna suffocation. And see what my opponent does. Five ball stand. I'm just trying to get those cards out of his hand. Yep. Oh. Last time. Can you imagine if lay down arms was instant? That'd be pretty good. Yep. Block. Okay, go. Let's go draw. Get the dogs out. Lay down arms. Another tie bar stand. Seems solid. Um, yeah, just block here again. Question is, do they have a third Tyvar stand? The answer to that question is yes. Yes, they do. One, two, three, four, five, six. Which is pass. One hundred percent. They got another Tyvar stand. Deal with this on the tie bar stand. No, okay, we managed to get through that. I'm happy with that. Vacation, it didn't play anything. Kick it a few times. Okay, they probably got Valiant, a uh, Valorant stance or something like that. Yep. Make a 1-1, one, one. I've got another Wandering Emperor, so it's fine. I make a 2-2, two, two, sorry, I've got another Wandering Emperor. Protect the suffocation for this. Okay, they got one card left in hand. Valorant starts. Another, wow, loads of protection spells. Incredible. Thinking well, but it's all good. Oh, all good indeed. Thank you. One, two, three, four, five. Good. Nozzle attack. Pass. Yep. Make it super obvious I got Wandering Emperor. Rock Priest. That's fine. Yep. The Wandering Emperor down. Make a 2 2. And then we'll block. Boom. Boom. They'll kill one of the 2 2s. That's fine. What do I want to grab? I'll probably grab a spirited companion. I think. Yep. Get the dog. Notification. So, uh, a spell. Get rid of that. Um, make another 2 2. 
Swing in. Okay, looking pretty good. Pretty good, especially if the Sarah Paragon lives, stays around. Yep. And they don't attack. And we got the laid-on arms as well. Well, okay, get the dog out. Run another card. These roadblocks for days. We'll buff up this guy. We'll lay down arms this guy. And we'll rumble in. Still vigilant, so I'm not too bothered. Okay, they're on 18. Um, yeah, let's play land and pass. Play land and pass. Ooh. That's a problem. Okay, they're rumbling in. There we go. Ooh. Ooh. Yep. Might as well. I transform you as well. We make a two two. Play the land. A swing. Draw a card. Ooh. Okay. So be a close game. Actually, I have to kill them next turn, actually. Think about it. Yeah, I have to kill them next turn. Or find a way to deal with Skrelv. No, oh, this is... tough. Yeah, I have to kill them next turn. I don't think I have enough. I don't think I do. Interesting. Interesting. Yep. I don't know if my opponent realizes that, but uh let's buff. Okay. Play Elspeth. Let's buff this guy. And then let's swing in. Um. Yep. Mm hmm. I had to keep two creatures back. Might be a bit greedy, but we'll have to wait and see. My opponent did the line of play I said last turn. They would have won. Because I would have been on 9 poison. But we'll see. I still could be dead though. Valorant stance kills me. Oh, does it kill me? Yeah, it does, yeah. Okay. Interesting. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, I think they, they... I don't think they saw the line of play there, but they could have killed me. My opponent's going first. Uh, yeah, this is definitely a mulligan. 100%. Uh, this is way better. Way better. Uh, I'm going to get rid of one lay down arms. I was saying I had a feeling it was going to be mono red. And, you know. 
very accurate. Right, there you go. That was a good draw as well. Red green, a beast caller. Okay, um, we'll play this and I'm gonna lay down arms. This just get out of here. Looking pretty good. Pretty good indeed. Hello, greeters. Okay. Lots of stuff. Uh, land. Um, Elspeth, make a guy, and pass. Mm hmm make another guy. Jump blockers for days. Yep. Okay, 4-4 four, four trample is pretty good. And that 5-5 five, five Calgary is his own face. Huh. Block here. Don't mind. Own face. Um. Don't know what else we could do. Okay. Well, that's when we get rid of Elspeth. Uh, land, dog. Yep. So we get farm hand. Oh, that's pretty good. Yep. Grab a planes. Mm hmm. Again. Trigger, I could draw a card. Another dog. Pretty good. Mm hmm. Big treasure. Peace cooler. Oh boy. Are they looking to fling this Alagreas in my face? looking like it. Mm-hmm. Block here. Block here. Realize the uh, beast called is a 7-7. Seven, seven. Okay. I will take seven. Uh, interesting. I need a removal. That's not removal. Um, you shoot me for lethal. Yeah, that's pretty, pretty much dead. All right, pen going first. I'm going to. Um, I'm going to keep hoping the non aggro deck. Hoping they're not. Okay. The land go. Uh, play the farm hand. Get land. That was a good draw. That. That was definitely a good draw. And then we got the wedding announcement. We'll play next turn. Hopefully, it doesn't get countered. Um, 
And we'll see how we go from there. Doesn't? Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Children. Same for one. Yep. Hmm. I don't think one of my opponents playing. I will attack for one because I want to get some threats down. I need the card draw at the moment. Nice. The flash in the Wandering Emperor. Tap target permanent. We get countered. No, interesting. What's my opponent playing? What is my opponent playing? Keep watch for intruders. Yep. Okay. We'll buff this guy. Cut down. Go. Sure. Alright, so my opponent is actually doing something. My opponent is actually doing something. Okay, land. Uh, swing in. Another cut down. Okay, we can resolve this Sarah Paragon then. Nice. Pretty good. And cheap removal. Uh, tie. Okay, well, that's Sarah Paragon dead. And the Wandering Emperor. Mm-hmm. Try not to miss. Next turn I'll probably just play this. Still Seraph, I think. Three. And the doggy. Grab a land. Uh we've got one, two, three, four. Yeah, we'll lay down arms here, Ty. Beautiful. Do life link, why not? Here we go. Nice, nice. Very happy. It's gonna make he's gonna draw a card. Okay. Not to be that great for my opponent here, but there we go, right. Um Give it a lifelink, why not? Get in there, get stuck in. Okay. They're on five. Another Sarah Paragon. Um and then pass. Keep the removal. Just in case my opponent might play anything crazy, uh, I'll just take the damage. On Ninja 2. Comes a copy of something? Okay. Oh. They're still dead, right? Oh no, not quite. They have a blocker. They have a blocker. Interesting. Two blockers. And they concede, alright. Managed to get their ninjas. Interesting. Okay, opponent's going first. I'm going to keep this hand. I quite like it. I quite like it. Okay. Maybe 
Do I can maybe control deck, maybe mm, yeah, probably control. I'm gonna lean towards control. The counter. Okay. Esper. All right. Another land, nice. A triple Poombringer Valkyries. My opponent's missing their land drops, so that's pretty good news for me. It does mean they're holding probably just a bunch of counter spells or removal. But okay, they found their land, Elspeth. Yeah, let's just get this guy out. So I can get countered. Or killed, whichever way. I've got three of them, so. <laughs> Memory deluge. They're digging for land. 100% land. Yeah. Get him in there. Oh, they found their land, Celestus. That's more mana. Uh, land. Um, let's swing him. Removal, sure. Oh, we can get Elspeth down. Make a one-one, and then pass. I've got a planeswalker down, that's like key in a matchup like this. Yep, okay, right, uh, make another one one. Get stuck in. Um, a wedding announcement. And pass. Pretty good. Uh, yep. Draw a card. Oh, they do have a way to deal with Elspeth. Okay. Annoying. Hence Esper control. And the depopulate, well. Wow. Okay. Looking pretty good for my opponent here. Let's kick it. Yeah, put him on ten. It'd be pretty tough, actually. They got cut down in hand. I'm not massively pressuring them, so they could easily just flash back memory deluge, find some more good stuff. Farewell. Yeah, there's a bummer. Okay, let's get this down, doesn't make a difference. What have we got? Sunfall. Let's get rid of one creature, sure. We can bring a Valkyrie. Yeah. The farm hand. And probably planes. And let's play it. And then it's over to your opponent. Go for throw. They definitely got removal, one hundred percent. One hundred percent. There you go, turn one around. Wedding announcement, sure. It's Valkyrie again. 
Give it a counter. Cut down. Yeah, we knew they had to cut down anyway. Awesome to use it at least. Negate. Okay. Make disappear. Make disappear. Sure. Well, now it's going to be a very, very tough game for me to win, I think. Absolutely. All I've got is just removal. My opponent's got two memory deluges. They got Eternal Wanderer in play. Yeah, I'll, I'll concede this. Tough. Tough game, that. So, not too bad with this deck. Not too bad. I kind of feel like a little bit 50 50 there, but it is a pretty decent deck. It does play on aggro. Control, as you just saw, it was just tough. Um, if they couldn't deal with the Elspeth, the Elspeth could potentially run away with the game, but that Void Rend was pretty brutal, and they just had so much removal. And yeah, we just can't run out of gas, really. With the removal wreck and a bank buster, this deck can't keep that card draw flowing. So and this is designed against aggro. If, you know, if you're up against aggro, I would say this deck is pretty good going. Anything I would change? I mean, you could draw maybe one copy of Boombringer Valkyrie and probably add in maybe like fourth copy of Spirited Companion. Something like that. But overall, I do feel like this deck is pretty good, especially if you have a problem with aggro decks. If you do want to give this deck a try, guys, of course, the deck is in the description below. And if you watch more standard content, make sure to click the video on the screen. And if you watch more magic content, you know what to do. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. All right, guys, that is it for me in this video. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.